Hey guys, it's Victor here again. Facebook just announced a new video conferencing service called Facebook Messenger Room. A service that will allow you to conference with up to 50 participants at no cost whatsoever. If you've not heard about Facebook Messenger Room or maybe you've, you've heard about it but don't know how to activate or start using it, then keep watching this video. And hey, I'll leave timestamps as table of contents to different sections of this video in the description box below so you can go straight to your section of interest. And be sure to stick around to the end of this video as I'll be using this new Facebook video service in a live demo with another tech YouTuber from Ghana. And please subscribe if you've not and turn on the post notification bell icon so that you'll be notified the next time and every other time I post a new video like this one. Seemingly everyone knows about Zoom by now, right? Father, mother, choir member, students and even your neighbors. Zoom.us went public last year and they have been having the moment of their life during the corona pandemic or lockdown as it was the only verified and trusted solution for digital meetings and hookups. It became so popular that it even went viral than the virus itself and in terms of popularity as people flocked to the service to keep up with friends, choir practice, gossip and even host emergency weddings for those brides that their 9 months timeline has started counting since February. Now, Facebook as Facebook that they are, always brings out a rival to any social media trending feature or breakthrough in other apps. For instance, they launched WhatsApp status, Instagram and Facebook stories to compete with Snapchat story, which was the only social media app with a story feature as at that time. So this time, Facebook launched Messenger Room to compete with other video conferencing apps, especially Zoom, that has enjoyed a lot of traction recently. So without any further ado, let's cut the chase and get into how to start using the Facebook Messenger feature that will allow you to create a conference room to accommodate up to 50 persons at no cost whatsoever. And guess what? You don't even need to be a Facebook user to join a conference room. Please know that you can now create Messenger rooms globally through the Messenger app or your Android and iOS smartphones and the Messenger website. However, only users in the United States of America will be able to create a chat room from the main Facebook app or page for now. First of all, I'll show you how to start using it on a desktop computer or a web browser, then I'll show you how to launch it on the Messenger mobile app. Now, this is how to start using the Messenger room on your computer. Go to messenger.com or click the messenger icon on the top left side of your Facebook home feed. At the top left side of your screen, you'll find the create new room icon. Click it and then click continue to join as yourself. It should prompt you to permit the app to use the camera and microphone. Then the room is created. You'll find options at the bottom to share your computer screen so that participants can see whatever is going on on your screen. This is handy and useful when you are doing a slideshow presentation. You can share an application window or the entire computer screen or just a browser tab. The second button will allow you to see participants of the conference. You can also lock the room so that no new participants will be allowed into the room. And you can send an invite link to people to join the video conference from here. The third icon allows you to turn off your video or camera so that people won't catch you sleeping during the meeting. The fourth icon mutes the microphone. This comes handy when you are in a noisy environment. You can mute your mic so others won't get distracted while you are still able to listen to the speaker. The last red icon allows you to leave the room. There is a settings icon at the top right hand of the screen for adjusting video and sound. You also find useful shortcuts at the bottom of the settings tab. Now to start using it on your mobile app, Make sure you are on the latest version of Facebook Messenger by going into Google Play apps to update the Messenger app. Once updated, open the app and switch to the People tab at the bottom right of the screen. Then switch to the Active tab at the top. Then click Create Room. Click Allow on all permission requests by the app if they pop up. Otherwise, the room will be created. You can choose who can join the video. You can allow everyone with the link or just your Facebook friends. The share link button allows you to share the video link to your friends. The first icon at the top will allow you to toggle your phone camera to either the front or back camera. The second icon will turn your camera or video off so that other participants can only hear your voice. You can end the video by hitting the close icon at the top right or choose to leave the video and be notified by a Facebook call when a participant or someone joins the room. You can add effects on your video by clicking on yourself and choosing any of the effects below. You will also see a shutter that will allow you to take a screenshot of all participants. There is also a link sharing icon. 
There's also a flip camera icon for flipping your phone camera and a mute icon for muting your microphone. Now, let me invite my friend Delpi from Ghana to join the video and let's do a conference. This will be fun, I promise. What's up, Delpi? How are you doing? Hey, Delpi. What's up? What's up, bro? How are you doing? I'm fine. I'm very fine. How is Ghana and the COVID situation there? Okay, yeah, so Ghana is very, very warm at the moment. And the COVID situation peaking at 5,000 now. But the recovery rate of, I think, 1,000 and 1,000. So is it, is it reducing or coming down? Is there hope? Are you seeing it coming down anytime soon? Uh, yeah, I don't know. It's in between. I don't know if you see anything now, but I don't need that. I was government officials come looking for me. <laughs> but, for the real, I think it's, it's not going to go very high anymore. Okay. Because you have a very high recovery rate now. You have okay. like 1,000 people who have recovered out of that 5,000. Okay. So, that's good news. That's a very good one. That's, so this is this is Facebook Messenger Room. It's a new service from from Facebook, um, and it will be like a rival to Zoom. Zoom became very popular now during this COVID COVID pandemic, and yeah. everybody, many people started using Zoom. Even even my grandmom knows about Zoom now. <laughs> COVID was just a very big advertisement platform for them. And and this one will allow um, for up to fifty participants in one video call, and um, it's actually free of charge, no charge whatsoever. Uh, so this is a new service from from Facebook. I, I I'm calling to test it out. I'm making a video on it, so I'm calling to see the features that that came with it. So I'm seeing from my own end, yeah, from my own end, I'm hearing you very clearly, and I can see you very clearly. I don't know how it is from your side. I can hear you very clearly too, except for the fact that there's at some point there are some audio pitches that sound like an echo. It sounds like bing bing, like bing. Oh, 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 oh. Sometimes just a so small pitch. Okay. That okay. So how easy or how hard was it to, you know, get into here with that link I sent you? Oh, it was very easy. All I had to do was just tap on the link and then just continue as my Facebook profile. And then voila, I was here with you. Oh, like, okay. Imagine, <laughs> okay i'm looking at the screen now i'm seeing some effects some features okay first of all there is a shorter button that will allow me to take a screenshot of our conversation let me do that quickly okay okay and then um, well, they are telling me here that you took a photo so they just told me that to take a screenshot <laughs> wow they don't want me to use your picture for anything <laughs> I'm seeing some faces, some masks here. Yeah, let me try some of, some of these. Wow. <laughs> ah. <laughs> I'm an astronaut, man. Okay, so this is for. <laughs> this, I'm not sure. I'm not sure I'll ever use this feature unless I want to just call somebody. In a... I meet. I don't. I don't see myself using it. <laughs> this is funny, man. I don't see myself using it. I don't see myself using it. Are, are you seeing are you seeing these effects from your own end? Yeah, because mine is inside there, so it's like I have to tap on my Oh okay. My video is in okay. So I have to tap on it and it shows up again. When I tap over my video from the square angle that it shows Okay, it will show up. I just see the effect. And there's a shutter button at your end too. There is a shutter button to, to screen screen grab. Okay. I'm seeing another tab here called activities. I think this one allows us to play, I don't know, a digital game or something. I don't know how it works. Let me see. Okay, okay you have it there too. Yeah. Okay, they say move your head to catch basketballs. Catch the basketballs. Okay. <laughs> this is fun. This is <laughs> oh, my brother is going to love this, man. I think I 
Lust. <laughs> wow, this is nice. This is nice. This is nice. 17, 17 to 4. 17 to 14. I'm also seeing a share share link feature here and there is there is a flip camera icon here so that you can flip the camera to the back camera the right camera a bit you can see uh, other options oh okay like lock camera. lock room yeah so you can you can you can you can turn off your speaker okay and you can also turn off your camera thank you so much Delpy, for showing up guys Delpy is a fine tech youtuber from ghana so go check out his channel with awesome contents for you all link in the description space below i noticed immediately that facebook messenger room has a clearer sound than zoom and the video quality too is also better even though the video quality might be dependent or partially dependent on your network speed and or whatever is going on in your network the user interface is somewhat easier than that of zoom although i recorded some deal breakers like the inability to schedule a meeting and share the meeting link before the meeting and just like we have in zoom and the inability of the host of the meeting to mute other participants mic to control noise just like we also have in zoom but one thing facebook messenger room has going for it is the fact that it is completely free to use Zoom, on the other hand, costs like $14 per month, except you'll be using the free version, which will only allow you to conference not more than 40 minutes. Facebook Messenger Room allows you to video chat with up to 50 persons without any charge. So finally, Messenger Room is something to try out if you're looking out on ways to cut costs and spending. Thank you so much, Delby, for showing up. Thank you guys for watching this one. And don't forget to check out any one of my other videos on the screen right now. Just any one of them this or this this or this choose one this or this also remember to leave a like and subscribe to the channel and i'll see you when i see you in the next one peace